In another example of an overreaction, eco-militants and net zero activists are having a meltdown because Trey's Coffee is the new environment secretary, even though the government is still going on with net zero. This is an absolute mess, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the show. The eco lobby, the net zero activists, they're all rattled because Trey's Coffee is the new environment secretary and they don't really care that Rishi Sunak's agenda is still net zero, that Rishi Sunak just banned fracking earlier today. No, they want more. So The Guardian did this article saying, how green will the new environment secretary Trey's Coffee will be? How green exactly? I mean, can we actually believe her that she wants to be green? Yes, that she is as green as you idiots. You're all as bad as each other right now. But they're having a meltdown for absolutely no reason. The guy who goes on TV every now and then, uh, this man, uh, George M. Monbiot, to uh, shout around who funds you, who funds you to all the right-wingers, he said, OMFG, coffee as environment secretary, goodbye to all we hold dear. Really? I mean, breathe, breathe, George, breathe. People then replied to George's tweet, more chaos. <laughs> Claire said, well, that is incredibly depressing. Crying emoji. <sighs> Get a hobby, guys. Get a hobby. There's another one. Heidi. Um, she has EU flag emoji. Some sort of plant emoji. That's just some leaves. France. Uh, more flowers. Some... <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. There's a pig there as well. She, uh, she said... She's a big fan of internal drainage boards, according to Miles King. So that's nice. Uh, the house and protecting our finest sites, not so much. Uh, just feel uh, the spare tonight. Okay. And this person, Joanne, apparently. Heartbreaking when you think of the impact we have on our wildlife. Mm. I'm just going to be speechless for a little bit because uh, I'm already triggered myself that um, this government have already moved towards socialism. They banned uh, shale gas and extracting shale gas. Uh, they're going to be uh, overtaxing small and medium-sized businesses while rich businesses and the corporations will find loopholes through expensive lawyers and accountants. This is actually happening. Then the lefties at the same time are still not happy enough. How left-wing do you want the government to be for you to stop complaining? Can you go even more left-wing than Richard Sunak's cabinet? No, probably not. I mean, not with the same Tory party. Probably, actually, if Anna Subri comes back, maybe. But unless you want Starmer, then stop complaining. This is still a bit of socialism that you wanted than globalism. They're doing your net zero. Calm down. We should be unhappy, not you. Let's take a quick break. We're going to come back. And tell you about uh, Jacob Rees-Mogg, what he's now up to now that he's on the backbenches. It's going to be an interesting one. Subscribe to the channel. Amaya TCN, we are the media.